Hi, my name is Sarah. I'm a member of the heating business development team from Daikin Europe. We're very pleased to introduce you Stand By Me, a new connectivity platform to support professional installers, end users and key accounts. In this short video, I'll explain you how it works and show you around the professional portal. Daikin Stand By Me connects professionals, end users, landlords and organizations such as property developers or chain shops. It's an after-sales service tool where end-users can extend the warranty on their installation or order maintenance packages. All Daikin professionals have an essential role in these service offerings. Stand By Me gives you the opportunity to attract new customers and tighten the relationships with existing ones. Next to a clear overview of all your customers and installations, Stand By Me also assists in scheduling maintenance visits. The reminder system will let you know if a new maintenance deadline is getting nearby, so you always stay up to date. With Stand By Me, you as Daikin professional can keep a complete digital logbook of your install base of Daikin products and consult it anywhere, any place, anytime via PC, Mac, tablet or smartphone. Interested in how the platform operates? Let's move on to the demo. This is the Daikin Stand By Me homepage. As a professional, you can register your account by clicking this button right here in the grey box. Please keep in mind that your local Daikin branch first has to approve your registration before you can access your account. If you already have an account, you can click this link to sign in. Let's access the account of a registered professional. Just fill out a registered email address and matching password to access the professional portal. The installation database gives you an overview of your installed base. For each installation, the commissioning date and warranty end date is mentioned. You can download your installed base and export it as a CSV file. By clicking the View button, detailed information of the installation can be retrieved. We will come back to that later. Once you've finished a job, you can add this installation to your installed base. The moment it's registered from your side, the installation gets the status commissioned. As a consequence, the end user is being asked to register from his side. If the end user accepts this installation or adds a new one himself, the status will change to registered. You can easily add an installation clicking this button. First you upload the commissioning document of the installation. Any file format can be used, Excel, Word, PDF, etc. Next you are asked to complete the form. Select the commissioning date and the type of product. Fill out the correct serial numbers and select the correct unit. Next is the installation address. Finally, indicate the type of customer you've been working for. This is usually a private person or a landlord. Invite the end user by filling out his or her email address and name. Click save to finish. A new account has been created for the end user. As you can see, the end user can now register its unit by using the commissioning code which has been sent by email. If the end user did not give you an email address, you can leave the commissioning code on site for later registration by the end user. Let's go back to the installations overview and take a look at the installation of Ms. Roman. All information related to the installation is provided in the general tab. Here you can check the installation address, installed equipment and end user credentials. Further below, you will find the warranty end dates. In case the end user bought add-on packages for an installation, such as extended warranty, they're shown on this screen. In the second tab, you can preview or download the commissioning document. The maintenance tab in the installation database gives you an overview of all scheduled maintenance deadlines. This will only appear if an end user has purchased an e-package, which includes maintenance. After this deadline, you have another 3 months extra to execute the maintenance. Once the maintenance is done, you're invited to upload the report. Once done, Stand By Me knows that the installation has been properly maintained and will precede the extended warranty. Upload the maintenance report and other additional files if you wish. Select the maintenance date and save the report. Once the report has been uploaded, the status changes to done and at all time you can consult the report. The next maintenance is being scheduled one year ahead. In the repair tab you have the possibility to add all repairs executed on the installation. 
Click the Add Repair button to add a new repair. Upload the repair report and if necessary some additional files. Select the repair date and fill out the detailed description. The maintenance part of the main menu gives you an overview of all scheduled deadlines in the future. Different colors are used to express the priority. A deadline that has been exceeded is highlighted in red. A yellow bar means the maintenance has to be executed soon. If the maintenance has to be executed in the far future, it's marked grey. The Repair tab shows you all repairs executed to the installations of your customers. Note that this is a voluntary action. You're free to upload the repairs of the installation. It gives you the opportunity to create a full logbook of an installation. We have come to the end of this video. I hope you've enjoyed it and for your information, much more is about to come on our connectivity platform Stand By Me. We'll keep you posted on new functionalities and tools which will make your life easier. Please contact your local branch for any question related to Stand By Me.